it is fall. Let's see, how many ways can you wear a scarf? y'all perfect i wanted to go ahead and do like a fall favorite video i find myself watching these literally all day so i wanted to go ahead and make my own i figured i'd do this today because it finally actually feels like fall i'm not talking about like it's october and it's 80 degrees and you're wearing a cute scarf anyways because you just really want it to be fall no, I'm talking about, like, I had to wear a jacket this morning to walk to work, and I was not complaining one bit. I think we'll just jump right into it. So I actually got this a while ago. It's the Tardius Kit by Tarte Makeup. Thanks, Sabira, for sending it to me. And I've been using it a lot for my, like, natural, everyday look, but I also have been using it because it has these gorgeous fall colors. I'm not sure if you can see them or not, but we'll see. So it has these gorgeous fall colors. I've been using Whimsy, which is like this gorgeous orange color, Mod, which is a pink, and also Vamp, which is a purple for more of like a darker night look if that's what I want. And then I've been putting Ethereal like in the inner corner of my eyes because it's sparkly. So thank you, Severa, for sending me this palette. It goes with everything. You can have a natural look and then it has darker colors for like if you want like a go on out look. So it's perfect. Since I kind of started out in the makeup realm, I figured I would also do a lipstick. This is actually what I'm wearing right now. It's actually Revlon, so you can just get it at like a drugstore or Target. And this is in Mauvey Night. So it's this great, just everyday fall color. And honestly, Revlon is just one of the most like reliable lipstick brands that I've used. I guess we'll transition from makeup to skincare. I actually got this Grown Alchemist Polishing Facial Exfoliant in my FabFitFun box. And I have absolutely loved it. It smells amazing. It smells like a really expensive spa, I'm pretty sure is what I said in my last video. It has just enough exfoliant to like really feel good on your face, but it's not too much where it dries your skin out because I have really dry skin. So I'm always hesitant to try new exfoliants. This has been my go-to, so I've been using this on my skin every other day and I think it's working. What, what's that thing that makeup? Go. Oh, look at it. Focus. I don't have that good of a camera, so I don't even know if it's going to focus in on that. Another skincare product that I've discovered this year is Luna Bronze. So this is actually a tanning moisturizer. It's not a tanning lotion. It's a tanning moisturizer. So this is their Glow Moisturizer. It says um, Mandarin lemon myrtle and orange blossom scent. So it says on the back that it's used for a gradual tanning moisturizer for every day. So it's not going to be as dark as your typical tanning lotion. It's just gonna give you like a subtle glow. And as you can see, my tan is completely gone. So I'm so excited to try this out. Be sure to follow me on Instagram so you can see more of like a full review on that. I actually found them on Instagram and here we are so I'm quite excited to try this out this is made in Australia and one thing that actually drew me to the product is that it is cruelty free and it's also vegan so if you're a vegan and you're looking to get a little bit of a glow this fall I would check them out so this is actually one of the things that has really gotten me into this fall spirit it's called the little book of Huga. it's pronounced so Huga is a Danish term. It says that it's the Danish secrets of happy living. And it's actually not really something that you can describe. It's just like that warm 
feeling that you get in the fall season when you just want to like curl up in a sweater and have a cup of tea and just be around friends and be comfy cozy. This is actually written by the CEO of the Happiness Research Institute in Copenhagen and the way he writes is just really relatable. He gets into um, more of the psychology aspect on it. There's recipes in here, there's interior design, there's some DIY projects, there's like who got outside of the home. It's just a really, really cute book. I would highly recommend it. And while you're reading your book, the greatest thing to have with it is tea. Since getting my cute little teapot in my Fat Fit Fun box, I've been drinking a lot more tea lately because it's adorable. So I found this uh, Tazo tea at the store, and this is the Zen tea. So this is the harmonious blend of green tea, lemongrass, and spearmint. So it kind of has like that lemony, minty flavor and it does have a little bit of caffeine in it which is probably the main reason why I got it. I'm trying to drink less coffee and that's not working very well but this is a good substitute. <laughs> and I wanted to throw in something fun that I found at Target of course. This adorable little shot glass. I'm all about Halloween decorations. And this was my favorite discovery. It's actually on the dollar rack, so you can get three of these for $3. And they're just adorable, and they're so fun. So if you have any like themed parties, they're just so cute. One thing that I found that's actually more of like a local discovery is Compass Coffee, which is located here in DC. They actually have a few locations, so I'll link their website down below so you can check them out. I actually just wrapped up filming like a girls weekend vlog in DC. So you're gonna see the coffee shop in that and that was my first time going there and since then, which was on Friday, and today is next Friday, so it's only been a week and I've already been back three times because it's so good. It's a local business. They actually roast the coffee beans in DC and it is like some of the best coffee that I've ever had and it's half the price of Starbucks and of course they still have like pumpkin spice lattes and chai lattes so I was really happy to see that getting into the fall spirit all right so that has been just a few of my fall favorites if you liked this video and want to see more of like my seasonal favorites please let me know. Be sure to like this video. The links for everything will be in the description box down below. And also, if you follow me on Instagram, you're gonna see a lot more of my fall favorites, so be sure to check that out. Is that just gonna be my thing, is like not knowing how to sign off videos? <laughs>